Welcome back. In this teaching video, I'm looking at 1.5 algebraic division. 1.5 represents chapter 1, section 5 of the Pearson A level Maths Pure Maths Year 2 textbook. Given that x squared plus 3x minus 2 all over x minus 1 in brackets multiplied by x minus 2 in brackets is equal to a plus b over x minus 1 plus c over x minus 2, find the values of a, b, and c. Now, the critical part of this question is the a. That a is a constant, it represents the quotient. Now, whenever you have a quotient within a question, that indicates that the given fraction must be an improper fraction, or you could say top-heavy fraction. So when we have a scenario like that, we must apply polynomial division in order to work out the quotient. Let's check that this is a top-heavy fraction. I can pick any x value. For example, if I pick x equal 10. So if I've got x equal 10 and I substitute into this fraction, I get precisely 16 over 9. So 16 over 9 is a top heavy fraction. And so we have to apply polynomial division. We must apply polynomial division in order to work out the quotient. So let's go ahead and apply polynomial division. So I've got my bus stop sign. Inside the bus stop, I've got x squared plus 3x minus 2. And outside, I've got the divisor, which is x minus 1 in brackets multiplied by x minus 2 in brackets. I'm going to expand this double bracket. So if I do this, I get x squared minus 2x minus x, which is minus 3x plus 2. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and apply polynomial division. I've got x squared divided by x squared, which is 1. I take the 1 and I multiply with this quadratic and that gives me x squared minus 3x plus 2. Now I must subtract the two polynomials. So if I do this, I get 0 for this one and over here I get 3x minus minus 3x which is 6x and over here I get minus 2 minus plus 2 which is minus 4. Okay, so the process terminates there. The 1 is called the quotient. Uh, the 6x minus 4 is called the remainder. Right, so this fraction here, x squared plus 3x minus 2 over x minus 1 in brackets multiplied by x minus 2 in brackets is equal quotient plus remainder over divisor. Okay, so this part over here is my divisor. So I've got quotient, which is 1, plus remainder, which is 6x minus 4, over the divisor, which is x minus 1, in brackets, multiplied by x minus 2, in brackets. So I've got the a value, which is 1. Okay, I've got that, no problem. I can write a equal 1. Now I need to calculate b and c. I can set this fraction equal to b over x minus 1 plus c over x minus 2. I must be consistent with my notation. I must use the letter B and the letter C. So we've got let 6x minus 4 over x minus 1 in brackets multiplied by x minus 2 in brackets equal B over x minus 1 plus C over x minus 2. Now I can combine the two fractions by cross multiplying. So if I cross multiply, I get b multiplied by x minus 2 plus c multiplied by x minus 1. All over x minus 1 multiplied by x minus 2. Since this fraction is equal to this fraction, we can set the numerators equal to each other. So we've got 6x minus 4 is equal b multiplied by x minus 2 plus c multiplied by x minus 1. We're going to use this equation in order to work out b and c respectively. I can set these two brackets equal 0. So I've got x minus 2 equals 0. This gives me x equal 2. And I've got x minus 1 equals 0. This gives me x equal 1. Now I'm going to use these x values and this equation in order to work out the values of b and c respectively. So let's start off with x equal 2. So when x is equal to, 
I can substitute x equal 2 into the left hand side. This gives me 8 equal substitute x equal 2 into the right hand side. This gives me c. So we've got that c is equal 8. Okay, let's move on. When x is equal 1, so I can substitute x equal 1 into the left hand side. This gives me 2 equal substitute x equal 1 into the right hand side. This gives me minus b. Hence, b is equal to divide by minus 1, so b is equal minus 2. So I've got my a, I've got my b, I've got my c. So now I'm going to put the icing on the cake. Therefore, we have that this given fraction here can be written as a, which is 1, okay, plus b, b is minus 2, so plus and minus becomes minus, we can write minus 2 over x minus 1, uh, plus c, which is 8, over x minus 2. And that there, ladies and gents, completes this teaching video 1.5 algebraic division. If you found the video useful, please don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment, turn on your notification bell so that you receive notifications every time I post a teaching video.